One way of creating wall openings is by editing the wall profile. Just simply select the wall. And you can see on your contextual tab, there is edit profile. Select. And then using this option, you are not just creating openings, but you have the capability to edit the wall shape itself using our sketch option or sketch tools here. Okay. Now let's try to create an opening. So I'm just going to draw here using line tool to create my opening. So here, two, three. And then I'll just use probably an arc. Now, for this kind of opening, you have to remember that it should be an enclosed loop. You can see there are intersecting lines at this corner and this side. So when I try to finish my sketch mode, you will see this error. Lines cannot intersect each other. So you have an option whether to quit or continue. So here we will just continue and then just trim this corner using trim extend to corner first I need to split this line so using split element split and then trim extend corner one and two and then on the other side one and two then finish edit mode Now, you can see here our opening here, and then just in case you want to modify it, just do the same process again by selecting the wall and then edit profile. You will return again to the sketch mode option. Or if you want to remove the profile or the opening or the shape that you have applied to the wall, you can just simply select reset profile here like this. Another method is by using wall opening tool. Just simply go to architecture tab. Under opening panel, you can see here wall opening. To select, now you need to specify which wall to apply the opening. Just click the wall and specify two corner points to create a rectangular opening. One, two. Then click here modify now you have to remember that using this option you are limited to a rectangular shape opening now you can select the opening here and if you want to adjust the size you have grip handles that you can adjust like so or you can use a temporary dimension to modify its distance Now, the void that you have created is actually a component. You can even copy or even move it. So, if you want to remove that, just simply select, then press delete. Lastly, you can also use wall hosted families, particularly door and window, because these type of families generally create wall openings as well. Now, in door family, you can load a specific type of opening here, M door opening, because unlike the other types, you can see here, there are created 3D components. And their opening is just a void just to show an opening on your wall.
then just simply place it acts as the same it acts the same way as your door family and press escape now if you want to create a different shape with a fixed dimension you just simply edit the family and create a new profile shape just like this one edit family and just simply select the opening click edit sketch so from here you're just modifying the shape of your void then finish edit mode then you can load it to your project now one advantage of using this type of opening is that you can create several types just like a template Or you can also add different parameters to control its shape and dimensions. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and comment below if you have any suggestions or topics you want me to discuss.